Climate change has introduced new and reintroduced a host of pests and diseases that appear to have come to stay. Research institutions such as the Center for Agriculture and Bioscience International, CABI, are not sitting idle and are looking to new ways to manage and control these plant pests and diseases. CABI Zambia has introduced new biological research modules using natural remedies such as friendly insects that feed on harmful pests like the African for armyworm. We have introduced another training module which we call biological control so that they can be able to know uh, the beneficial insects that are there killing the bad insects. And these insects are good insects, we call them farmer's friends. Of course, we cover areas also that um, include reducing uh, the impact of uh, pesticides on the environment. And Kabi Africa Youth Manager Diogratias Magero has called on African governments to create and open up opportunities in the agricultural space for youth to create income and employment. We need to open up agriculture and the opportunities within agriculture for youth to see how they can make money without thinking, oh, agriculture is a punishment, or oh, agriculture is poverty, or oh, agriculture is pain or dirty. And that's why we are saying they are value chains. Meanwhile, youth have called on their fellow youths to engage in farming as the future is agriculture. I can't live, I just dream, eat, sleep agriculture, and I think it's the best decision I've ever made for myself. Research in agriculture, it takes us a step further to, to see, okay, what can we improve in regards to this? How can we increase yield of our crops without destroying uh, the biology of the crop? Reporting, Amachona Kasambala in Lusaka.